It's about seven o'clock, so we're approaching the final hour for the 2020 Taste of Columbus. As a member of Central Community College staff, I am so pleased that we are a recipient this year and that we can fund a future for a student. We also want to thank all of you for participating in this year's Taste of Columbus. It has been a different year with COVID. With the uh, 20 year anniversary, we've done things different. We have a totally virtual online auction. And if you haven't been a participant yet, we hope within this last hour, you'll register to bid. We also have been selling raffle tickets for two, not just one, but two electric bikes. They're each worth $1,500 a piece. So you have twice, as, twice the lucky chances to win. And then finally, we've been selling a passport, which we will continue to sell. They're $30, but they will give you more than $150 worth of value. 35 businesses, restaurants, wineries, bakeries, um, all kinds of culinary vendors throughout a 25 service territory where Central Community College is located. Those passports will be for sale um, and for, for good through March 31st. Um, so make sure you take advantage of these last items because this is the last hour. And we thank all of you that have signed up to register on our site. Um, it's amazing how many bids we have already. Um, but if you haven't bid, um, across your screen will show our website that you need to go to. And it's really easy. You just put in your name, an email address, give us your credit card, and you'll be all set to go to, to start uh, making some great bids on some of those great op options that we have for you. And speaking of some of the great options, one more time, what are some of the ones that you're watching and what are some of the ones that we want to see go well? I'm still watching the garage makeover. I'm really hoping <laughs> I get that one. <laughs> what about you, Kathy? Oh, for me, I'm so proud of how those um, benches made out of our gym floor look. They're just beautiful conversation pieces and it'll be a great addition to anyone's home or business. And I'm excited just about everything. I mean, I could say it's a golf package or I could say it's, a, it's the Husker print or I could say it's the um, mosaic little bird houses or the experiences that you have with friends. But just uh, any, any of the items out there are just wonderful and they'll fit the perfect niche for you, for your family, for your friends, a gift for Christmas or just a gift, something to look forward to next spring. I think the most important part is, um, sure, you're gonna get a great item out of it, but the philanthropy, the giving to others, the helping our students uh, achieve their goals and go out and make a difference, that's the real win in the Taste of Columbus this year. And for the Chamber, you certainly help support the program of work that we do year round. It has been a different year, but we're still there for you and we're very supportive of all our businesses who have been so generous to us through this process. Uh, just one last reminder, as we finish out this last hour, we'll break away from, um, from this conversation at 745 and we'll attend a Facebook Live on our Columbus Chamber Facebook page. And there we'll pull a couple of names for that raffle and those electric bikes. So again, that'll be a live Facebook um, experience at 745. We hope you join us for that. And that'll be the last 15 minutes, so you'll only have the last countdown to put in your final bids on your items. Hey, Jean, is there a time when folks who have bid successfully need to stop by the chamber in order to pick up their packages? Yes, once the, once the bidding closes and once the Taste of Columbus is over, we ask that all the winning bidders, and you will get notified that you are the winning bidder, we will come to the chamber the next day and through the following Tuesday, so through October 13th, we'll have your items ready. You can come down to the chamber and pick them up. This has been a really fun adventure, and we thank everyone who has supported Taste of Columbus, all the businesses that have been so generous in their donations, and um, just really appreciate everyone's support of our efforts, um, helping students, helping businesses in the local area. One last time, help us fund a future. Thanks for participating in Taste of Columbus 2020. Thank you very much on behalf of the Chamber and the Central Community College. Thank you for making a difference.